I, Professor Masood Rama, National President of AIMS, Association of Indian Management Institutes, which is the second largest association of these schools in the world. I would like to share about one to three seconds, I think, less than three minutes. Uh, this week we organized the National Kabi Sampela in Hyderabad on national integration this Tuesday. And I would like to mention that a few of the management gurus are present, like Professor Vaitya Bhushan and Shahrukh Abdekarji, they have been using the Urdu literature and poetry for their management classes and training program. And I would like to mention that, and Professor Tindraoji will agree that, and uh, Professor Uday Parikji used to use our used to have a lot of interest about Urdu poetry and literature. So from that Kavi Sammelan, I would like to share one of the lines. One of the poets he, he told there in our Kavi Sammelan, Hamara huna bhi kis kaam ka, Hamare na hone pe kisi ko kuch hi karna ho. The poet is telling that what is the point of our existence? That if you are not available or if you are no more, Nobody remembers us. This is the point. Hamara huna bhi kis kaam ka hamare na hone pe kisi ko kuch kita na ho. And this is equally supported by one of the title of Robin Sharma's book. It is called Who Will Cry When You Die? He has it back. The point what I am going to tell, we had our elders, management experts and management groups. Whether it is Professor Dhani Kisnaji, we remember him for international networking and he was a social scientist. Our Professor Ravi K. Matai, a Diane Ahmedabad institutional builder. Similarly, Professor K.P. Basu, or K.S. Basuki, the founder of Jamalal Bajaj Institute of Management, and Professor K.P. Chanti, one of the founders of AM Calcutta. Or I can say, I can use Professor P. L. Kandan, Prakash Lal Kandanji, basically the first Indian who, who was CMP for the first part in those days. These are the names. And most prominent name is Professor Uday Parikji. I think we must recognize their contribution, their values, and whatever efforts he put, not only for the management, particularly for the HR, OD, and learning. And because of that, most of us, we call him as father of modern HR initiatives. Or we call him as, say, flag bearer for OD and learning. I think we remember. We remember him today, and we remember, we remember him for the future. Thanks. Thanks.